Hi, my name is Mike Montefusco with the National Weather Service. On behalf of the National Weather Service's National Wave Team, I'd like to discuss some exciting changes that are coming to our coastal waters forecast regarding how we forecast ocean waves. As part of the rollout of the revised coastal waters forecast with enhanced wave detail, we wanted to help you visualize the difference between short and long period wave systems. The animation shown here shows what a 6-foot wave at 14 seconds may look like on a boat in the open water. Notice the time between successive waves and also the relatively smooth nature of the waves. Meanwhile, here is an animation of a 4-foot wave at 5 seconds. Even though the heights are smaller than the long period wave system shown in the previous animation, the frequency of the waves hitting your boat and the steepness can significantly impact navigation and may actually be more challenging to deal with than the long period waves. In general, very short period waves can be treacherous, particularly on small boats due to their steepness. Meanwhile, longer period waves are less steep and may be easier to navigate through. However, longer period waves also pose hazards that larger ships should be aware of, along with shoaling hazards for just about any watercraft near inlets and shallower water. Finally, this animation is an illustration of what is a fairly common occurrence in the ocean. Imagine the arrows on this graphic are different wave groups that are all impacting the sailboat at the same time. The various wave groups impacting this sailboat are likely producing some pretty rough conditions as the boat has waves coming at it from all different directions. For more information on the revised coastal waters forecast with enhanced wave detail, please visit weather.gov slash marine slash wave detail.